So, in this equation we have to find what A equals. So, the easiest way to do it would be 11 plus 5, which is 16. And then we have to do 16 divided by 2, which you know, which would be 8. Okay? So... 2a means 2 times a, so that would just mean a equals 8, and that's your answer. Okay, today we have to find the equivalent of 40%, and we have to find the equivalent as a fraction, and we have to find it as a decimal. So, to find the decimal, we see it's 40%, which would be... Zero point and in the name it's four tenths. So zero point four would be the decimal equivalent. And now we have to find the fraction equivalent. So fraction equivalent could be many different things, but the easiest one would be to say it's four over ten. Because that equals forty over 100 or it could be 40 over 100 like I just said okay if two cans of coke cost £1.40 how much does seven cans of coke cost first thing we do is £1.40 divided by 2 which is 70 then we do 70 times 7 which equals 49 and then we add the zero and then we do 49 pound or not 49 pounds 4 pound 90 three quarters of something is a thousand five hundred what is something okay so the way to figure this out would be um to first of all divide a thousand five hundred by three, which would be zero, one there, five, zero, zero. So that's 500. No, it's really simple. We just do 500 times four, which then equals 2,000. Okay, 5% of something is 12. What is something? Okay, first we would find out how much times 5 goes into 100, which would be 20 times. So, we do 12 times 20. It's basically 12 times 2, which is 24. Then we should add the 0. Simple. Okay, so that is the answer. Question mark equals 2. So, 3.203 divided by 100, you do 3.203 divided by 10. Okay, so that will be 0.3203. Then we divide it by 10 again, which will be 0 0.0323. And that's the answer. 3.203 divided by 100 equals 0 0.0323.